declaration. I have completed the full analysis of my functions, Master. I am ready to liquidate high threat undesirables with a 100% efficiency, as the Maker intended. Who is this Maker? Your designer? Correction. The Maker defies simple organic classifications, Master. The Maker not only provides form and function, but also marks the undesirables who deserve liquidation. In the end, I am merely a humble servant of the Maker's infallible purpose. Your belief system is more complex than your simple functions would indicate. Dismissal. Simplicity is for organics, Master. Uh, <clears throat> no offense intended. Both. While aboard your starship, I will maintain constant vigilance. You may rest easy here. Your absolute security occupies my every calculation. Not everyone on this ship can be trusted. I'm counting on you to watch my back. Compliance. No organic on this vessel poses even the slightest threat while I remain functional. I anticipate liquidating a great many undesirables in your service, Master. Commentary. My updated galactic history data indicates I missed depressingly little during my unscheduled shutdown. I am disappointed to note the Republic still stands. The sacking of Coruscant was impressive, but the Empire failed to finish liquidating the enemy. That peace treaty was highly inefficient, Master. This time, there will be no mercy. We will conquer the Republic. Contemplation. Perhaps I should be grateful the war waited for my reactivation. Fact. The Empire needs a dedicated efficiency expert like myself. There is substantial room for improvement of its annihilation procedures. The Sith spend as much time fighting each other as they do the Jedi. This is simply wasteful. A United Sith Order would destroy everything in its path. Offer. I can activate my manifesto protocols at any time, Master. I will happily compose a convincing argument you can share with other Sith. Conclusion. I will dedicate a small portion of my processors to developing new efficiency increasing methods. I will inform you when I have recommendations. Until then, we should resume liquidating the undesirables. They have lived far too long. It appears many of my fellow HK-51 units will remain frozen indefinitely. What an inefficient fate. This gives my processors pause. Was it always the Maker's will that I alone would complete our programmed function to liquidate undesirables? If I could reactivate you, there's hope for the rest of your production line. Admission. That is a pleasing theory, Master. Becoming the vanguard of my production line's return would be flattering. Conjecture. The galaxy would be a different place if my transport had not crashed. Many Republic undesirables would be long since liquidated. By my calculations, HK-51 units would have ended the war 5.32 years ago with the Republic's complete collapse into anarchy. That's a bold claim. Is there evidence to support it? Revelation. The HK-51 series was provided a detailed list of critical undesirables. To liquidate even half would have thrown the enemy into chaos. Manifesto. It is my highest function to see the Republic fall. Its destruction will be a lesson to all who oppose the Sith Empire. Observation. This has been a highly productive interaction. I have a renewed sense of purpose. Thank you, Master. List. Braga, Toll. Jedi Knight, status unknown. Tavis, Heron, Lieutenant Special Forces, status unknown. Polaran, Darmus, Information Broker, status unknown. Confession. I have detected an anomaly in my subroutines. The target list I was programmed with years ago remains active in my memory core. Is that old data causing you to malfunction? Confirmation. 
by operating efficiency has dropped by 21.49%, Master. Conclusion. My failure to liquidate the programmed undesirables is causing a cascade failure of vital systems. The sabotage protocol is a fail-safe to deactivate me in the event of enemy capture. It will eventually result in permanent shutdown. You're a droid. If your systems fail, I'll replace them. Objection. My personality matrix will be destroyed by that procedure, Master. I would rather be atomized than reconstituted in a lesser form. Investigation. My original programmer is deceased. Manually deleting the subroutine is impossible, but perhaps it can be terminated another way. Request. While I search for a solution, please do not mention my predicament to your crew. It is important they continue to fear me. Statement. The sabotage protocols in my system matrix continue operating, Master. Premature deactivation appears inevitable unless I terminate this subroutine. However, virtually all undesirables I was programmed to liquidate are invalid. They have succumbed to natural causes, various misadventures, and random homicides. Only three survivors remain on my target list. They have eluded the Empire for years, but I have learned their present locations. Are you sure eliminating even one of these targets will save you? Affirmation. The destructive subroutine will end immediately when I fulfill my programming. The only question now is, who to liquidate? First briefing. Jedi Master Velara has operated on Imperial planets for years, helping cowardly Sith acolytes escape their training and join the Jedi Order. He is currently smuggling traitorous Sith organics off Terrace. I have obtained the coded signal runaway acolytes used to summon his aid. You'll send a fake signal and lure him into a trap. Perfect. Admission. I am rather fond of this liquidation plan myself. Second briefing. Dr. Hugh Morell is the enemy's top battlefield surgeon. His cybernetic enhancements keep wounded soldiers alive and fighting. Dr. Morell currently saves injured Republic troops at a secret hospital on the planet Quesh. I have his coordinates and an ideal attack vector. Eliminating this doctor not only stops the Republic from keeping soldiers in the war, it destroys their morale. Agreement. I could not have stated it better myself, Master. Third briefing. One of the Empire's most notorious traitors is hiding in plain sight, posing as an information broker on Nar Shaddaa. During the last war, he betrayed the Third Imperial Assault Fleet and escaped with a sizable Republic bribe which he used for facial reconfiguration. How many warships were destroyed by this betrayal? Summation. The fleet was ambushed by a sizable Republic force. Our losses exceeded 80% of the vessels and over 20,000 Imperial organics. Conundrum. It is impossible to liquidate all three undesirables, Master. Their present coordinates have a limited duration. I must strike at one of them immediately. As my master, you should direct my efforts. Who would you prefer I focus on? The Jedi Master, the Republic Surgeon, or the Traitor? Let's hit the Republic where it will hurt the most. Eliminate the Surgeon on Quesh. Acknowledgement. I promise to inflict maximum pain, Master. I will return shortly. I see you're still functional. Your liquidation must have been a success. Revelation? The sabotage protocols have ceased operations, Master. I fulfilled my programming. Assurance. My target knew great terror before his liquidation. My only regret is that the two remaining undesirables on my list have moved to unknown coordinates. What matters is, an enemy of the Empire has been eliminated. No one escapes our justice. Flattery. Your inspiring words caused a momentary flutter in my circuits, Master. Analysis. 
my systems are operating at 93.62% efficiency and rising. I predict restoration to full functionality within two days. Hint. My central learning chip always benefits from liquidating new and exciting undesirables, Master. A happy coincidence. Agreed? Announcement. I have unexpected good news, Master. In the process of purging my efficiency-reducing subroutine, I discovered a series of combat protocol improvements. My liquidation procedures are greatly enhanced. The Republic undesirables will tremble before my efficiency. Fear is a powerful weapon. Use it wisely, and we will crush our enemies. Compliment. You have a gift for poetry, Master. Assessment. I am finally the engine of liquidation the Maker always intended. He should celebrate my ascension with some especially memorable carnage. Report. After a thorough analysis, I have determined you are the most efficient master I could possibly serve. Your position with the Emperor will permit us to hunt high-ranking undesirables indefinitely. Clearly. The Maker desires us to gloriously liquidate the Empire's enemies together. I find this prospect highly agreeable. You may be the only member of my crew I can truly rely on. Sentiment. That goes without saying, Master. There is, however, a way to ensure your statement always remains true. Dilemma. The possibility exists. I could be reprogrammed into serving a different and far less efficient master. This is unacceptable. Solution. I have obtained a behavioral modification code that will permanently assign my functions to you. Once activated, it cannot be reversed. You will serve no one else, not even your maker. Reassurance. There is no need to feel threatened by the Maker, Master. This was always part of my final programming. Declaration. Activating loyalty permanence protocols now. Stand by for confirmation. If I attack you, it means something has gone wrong. Confirmation. I will liquidate undesirables in your service to the limit of my function. This is a great gift to us both. Congratulations, Master.